Hi, everybody. Welcome back to my studio. This is Marcy Tilton. Come on in, and I want to show you the next step in the collar. So what we're looking at here is going to be the front, and I very much always do this once I've pinned it. I like to pull it open and see, okay, am I on track? So what I've done is I have machine basted this little left front piece first, and then I placed the upper left piece on top of it and basted. Machine basting is worth its weight in gold. So I'm pretty sure now that the collar is in position. The rest of the collar I've pinned like this. So we're going to sew from here to here. We're going to sew this collar in three stitching, stitching steps. And I'm going to stop stitching right about here, right about right there. Not quite at the edge of my facing. So I'm going to stitch through all layers. Another little trick I want to share with you is the fact that I put my pins right on the seam allowance and I thread them through so they're really secure and that way it's going to hold things and when I come to the pin I pull it out. So I'm going to stop stitching right about there, break the stitching, then we're going to shift and we're going to stitch just through two layers. So we're just going to stitch the remainder of the collar around to the other side just through the under collar and the body of the garment. The next step we're going to do is right at this end stitching I'm going to make a clip. So I'm going to go ahead and sew that and come back and we'll do another little video so that you can see how the process works. And just as an aside, I do a lot of fussing. I baste, I pull out, I retry. It doesn't always work the first time. We're doing things one at a time and uh, we have to, every garment is gonna be different. So I'm gonna go sew this and then I'll come back and I am gonna show you the next step. 